Welcome back to another fantastic episode of Jetline Marvel. In this video, we'll look at the airplane comparison between the Comac C919 and Embraer E195E2. The C919 is the first domestic product of China that was developed along with Comet Company for both narrow and wide-body aircraft. The program was launched in 2008, and the first prototype was finished in 2015. It then underwent numerous tests in China to demonstrate its capabilities. Finally, on September 29, 2022, it received its first airworthiness certificate from the Chinese Civil Aviation Authority, and on December 9, 2022, this aircraft was delivered to China Eastern Airlines in Shanghai. Currently, there have been 800 orders for aircraft from various clients, with the majority of those orders coming from China. As the continuous sanctions imposed by Western nations on Russia, if demand increases, China will be a key player in exporting some Comac aircraft to Russia. The medium-range jet airliner Embraer 195E2 was created by the Brazilian company Embraer. For major airline operators, it is the most promising jet because it may be used for regional connections. The aircraft was introduced during the 2013 Paris Air Show. 2016 had seen the launch of the E190-E2's first variant. And in 2018, it began operating in the operations with Widero as its first client. It has three different types of aircraft, depending on the number of seats and trip distance. Embraer targets lower fuel consumption of 16 to 24 percent and maintenance costs per seat of 15 to 25 percent. Built on the first version of the E-Jet, it features a new fly-by-wire system, new pylons, landing gear, horizontal stabilizers, cabin air system, air cycle machine. The Airbus A220 is a direct competitor in this market, and its cost is $91.2 million, whereas the E195-E2's cost is only $60.4 million. Embraer has currently received an order for 227 E195-E2 aircraft, of which 39 have been delivered to customers. Let's compare both aircraft. Comac offers two different seating arrangements, with 168 seats for one class and 158 seats for two classes. Additionally, Embraer's contains 146 seats for the single class and 120 capacity seats in the two classes. The Comac aircraft is 127.7 feet long, while the Embraer is 136.2 feet long. The Comac wingspan is 110.3 feet, while the Embraer's is 110.6 feet. The Comac is 39.2 feet tall, while the Embraer is 35.8 feet tall. While the Embraer can carry payload of 16,150 kilograms, the Comac can carry up to 18,900 kilograms. The operating empty weight of Embraer is 35,700 kg and Comac is 45,700 kg respectively. The maximum takeoff weight for the Embraer is 61,500 kg and Comac is 78,900 kg. The C919's travel range is approximately 5,575 km while the E195's range is 4,917 kilometers. 
The C919 CFM engine generates 129.9 kN of thrust, whereas the Embraer's two Pratt & Whitney engines can produce up to 102 kN of thrust. The C919 has a list price of approximately $99 million, while the Embraer costs $60.1 million. Please let us know which aircraft you prefer. Please share your thoughts in the comments.